That's it. Today was the final straw. I've had it. I can't take it anymore. I can't take the silence. I saw it happen to a student today in class. That's right. He got beat up by subtraction. That's right, subtraction. And you know, I never told anybody, but when I was in fourth grade, subtraction beat me up too. And that's it. I've had it. I'm making my stand, and I'm going to show you how I'm going to do it today. I'm going to boycott subtraction. That's right, boycott. I might never do subtraction again. What do you think of that subtraction? I'm going to show everybody how to do it. There it is. Subtraction. Blech. When I was in fourth grade, a problem just like this, you know what it did to me? Kicked me in the shin, poked me in the eye, and took my lunch money. That's right. I was going to eat an ice cream sandwich that day. But no. No subtraction. I'm not going to let you do this to another student ever again. No. Here's what I saw a student do today. This business. Turn this into a 10. Got to borrow from this guy. Turn that into a 10. Hey, you don't want anything? Got to borrow. Turn this into a 12. Hey, can't do that. I turn into borrow from this guy, nine two nine two, and then did this four ten minus six four ten minus ah subtraction. Why'd you taunt me so? And then he did this. Boom. Oh no. Oh no. Well, I'll tell you something. One, the answer's not four hundred fourteen. Two, he had to take. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight steps to do this. No wonder he got it wrong. Well, I'm here to tell you subtraction. No student's going to get this wrong again because we're going to boycott. We're going to boycott subtraction. We're never going to do subtraction again. And I'm going to show these kids how. All right, subtraction. It's time for everybody to see what you've been up to. Ha <laughs> ha. Here you are, 3,300 and 2,996. Now this little picture I drew is a math model, and it's going to show everybody that they don't really need to do subtraction. <laughs> ah, so what are we looking for? What is subtraction really? It's this space in between two numbers. This one, no, this number's bigger. This one's number smaller. Ah. And subtraction just goes backwards. Starts with the big number, and I'm not even going to write a subtraction symbol, eh, and it goes backwards down. But wait a minute. If you really understand subtraction, you don't have to ever subtract again. You can add up. Watch this. All I need to do is go from 2,996 to 3,300. Now, watch and learn. Now take this subtraction. Watch what I do to the 2,996. I'm just going to add 4. That's right. 4 subtraction. 4. And you know what that turns into? That turns it into 3,000. And you now know what I've done? I've just jumped from 2,000. I've jumped right there. And all I needed was to add 4. Now you know what I can do? Huh? Look at this subtraction. Look. Look what I'm doing here. I'm going to add up. I'm going to add, look at how easy this is, 3,000 to 3,300, ha <laughs> ha, subtraction. The answer to that is easy to see, it's 300. So my answer, all I did was jump up 4 to 3,000, and then I added from there, I added 300, I added, and there's my answer. So if you go from 296 to 330, you go 4 and 300, which is 300. Four. I could do that in my head subtraction. That's right. If everybody in the world learns this trick, learns to add up, we won't even need subtraction anymore. And you'll never pick on anybody again. Join me in my fight to boycott. That means don't do it. Boycott. Subtraction. <coughs> Eeks.